job, son. Thank you, thank you. You should take him out for ice cream this summer. Yes. So, son, how's school? School is going really good. Really? Have you joined any clubs? No clubs, just popularity. How's that going for you? It's going just fine for me because I have friends all over and the teachers seem to respect me, so. Wow. That sounds really good, son. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's my... Yo! your excuse? Uh, I didn't get that much sleep last night. That sounds like a personal problem. Go take a seat. trouble in class Miguel what's going on I haven't been getting enough sleep at home that seems like a personal problem you don't understand I've been getting too much assignments assigned to me and it's too much work well you need to fix that up Miguel I attempted to contact your parents they don't seem to be answering you can just leave I don't get this, like... I'm, I'm done. I can't do this. I can't. Oh, what's up? I've been getting calls from the principal about you being asleep in class? What's that about? Alright, I admit, I was sleeping in class. What are you gonna learn? Are you ever gonna get stuff done? Why are you being so hard on him? He needs to take accountability for his own actions. He's clearly just tired though, can't you just see that? He needs to get it through his thick skull that he can't be sleeping throughout the whole day. Maybe he got the thick skull from you. Oh. You're thick in the head. Me. Clearly I'm the only one that's level-headed around yeah. here. You're the one yelling at her kid. He's the one that needs to learn. They're always hard. Terrible news. Fortunately, after your accident, Miguel has fallen into a coma. He's been asleep ever since. My boy, Miguel. Get better soon, son. It's okay. Miguel, please wake up. It's been two years. 
I've waited so long for you to wake up, please, son. Oh my gosh, Miguel, you're back. Where am I? You're, you're in the hospital, you've been asleep for two years. Two years? I've missed you so much. Two years? Son, it's gonna be a little different now that you've woken up from your coma. Why? I'm sorry to tell you this, but your mom passed away. It's okay, we're gonna get through this together. I'll help you out with whatever you need. It feels good that we get to spend time like this now. I agree. You know, since your mom passed, it's been pretty hard. But I plan on spending a lot more time with you, son. Really? I've been getting less hours at work. So I should be at the house more. And we're going to be seeing a lot more of each other. That's good to hear, Dad. Of course, son. 